Hey, Billy here with the Homebrew Academy doing a review of the Rare Beer Club, the Rare Beer of the Month Club. So I first ordered from these guys, God, probably uh, five or six years ago, and figured I should uh, shoot this video and just tell you what I think and help you decide if the club is right for you or maybe a, a friend that you want to, or a family member you want to give it to as a gift. So the way it works is you get two bottles every month, two 750 milliliter bottles like so. So this is from last month. And they come in a box. This is the box, just like this. It's got this nice, really protective foam packaging here. Never had an issue with leakage or breakage, anything like that. The bottles are always in really good shape. And a bonus too, if you do beer trades like I do, you ship home brews and other beers to friends, you can reuse these. These are fantastic uh, for doing beer trades. So, Two bottles every month, which is different than most clubs. Most clubs, you get the 12, 12 ounce bottles every month. Now, there's three things that I really like about this club. First, you can tell that these are beer people. Uh, the guys, that, uh, guys and gals at Rare Beer Club, they really know their stuff. So you get these descriptions every month with your beers. So there's one for each beer. And you can see there's a lot on here, which I think is awesome. I, I love sitting down, reading about these beers as I'm drinking one. And when you read through these, the descriptions are excellent. They give you a great history of the beer and, uh, and the brewery as well. Number two is the beer quality itself. You get really good, really exotic beer. So this is from Nebraska Brewing Company, great brewery. Melange et Trois, a Belgian style ale, uh, bottle conditioned and aged in Chardonnay barrels. That's what I'm talking about. You get stuff like that. This is from one of my favorite breweries and uh, I wish I could get them more often. Jester King in Austin, Texas. This is a farmhouse, get this, a farmhouse alt beer with smoked malt. That's what I'm talking about. So you get stuff that's really unusual, uh, really unique. It's usually up there in ABV, so you get a lot of bang for your buck. These are definitely beers to age. Most of them are beers to age, which I normally don't recommend aging beers. Most beers, in my opinion, should be drunk fresh. But these are great if you're a beer geek who likes to build a cellar. I mean, these are normally perfect cellar beers. And you get a lot of international beers as well. So I've gotten beers from Cyprus, from uh, Germany, from uh, Italy, a lot of Belgian beers, South America even. So there's a, a whole lot of uh, variety. And you're going to try stuff that you just can't get otherwise. What they actually do is they brew a lot of beers exclusively for the Rare Beer Club. So literally you can't get these a lot of these unless you're in the club, which is different than the clubs, the more, uh, I guess, popular mainstream clubs where you get the, the 12 bottles at a time because they're producing so much of those that they, they can't really go to the smaller breweries. The small breweries can't keep up with that demand, so they have to go to larger breweries. So you don't get as rare a selection with those as you do with this. Third thing I really like about this club is the flexibility. So you have a lot of flexibility with your membership. You can skip over a month completely. So you can look at the beers that are coming up and if you don't like what you're getting, if you don't like say Belgian beers and you see you're getting those, you can skip right over them. You can swap out, um, you can skip one beer if you want. You could swap out one beer for a prior month's beer. You can swap out both beers uh, for a prior month's beer. And, and you can order beers that you got uh, maybe a month ago or two months ago. So if you really liked the, if I really enjoyed this beer, uh, which I do, if I want, I could go back and order a few more bottles of this. So that's really cool and that's something that's pretty unique to this club. Bottom line, this is a great club for beer geeks. So if you're buying this for yourself, if you're into styles like double IPAs and barley wines and sour ales, they do a lot of wild ales and sour ales, things like that. You're going to like this a lot. I know a lot of beer of the month clubs are given as gifts. So if the person you're buying it for is into those types of beers, they're, if you know that they're a beer geek and they're into that crazy stuff, they're really going to enjoy the beers they get in this club. Uh, only real drawback, you know, beer quality has been awesome. The customer service has been awesome. Uh, the packaging, like I said, has, has been perfect. So the only real drawback to me uh, is the price. And, uh, and don't quote me on the price because, you know, those things, they change all the time. So definitely check the website. Uh, I checked it earlier today and it came to uh, about $50, including shipping per month to have uh, these two bottles shipped. Uh, a lot of that is shipping and handling because these things are heavy and shipping ain't cheap. 
So I hope that helped, and uh, if you are into craft beer and more exotic beers, I really don't think you'll regret signing up for the Rare Beer Club. At least give it a shot for a month or two and see what you think. Cheers.